Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Valerie Cavazos. Every day in our schools, children are teased, threatened, and tormented by bullies. It's a pervasive problem, one that Nine on Your Side has been following for several months. The latest, just last week, Nine Sawadita High School wrestling students were arrested for hazing and bullying another student in a locker room. After one mom saw this story, she was outraged, like many of you that something like this could happen. She contacted Nine on Your Side about a group of Tucson teens who are tackling the bullying problem, putting their artistic talents together to teach others the real consequences of bullying, peer pressure, and following the crowd. Nine on Your Side's Alexis Fernandez joins us with more on this effort. Alexis? Well, Valerie, these teens are using music and drama to spread what they say are the truths that are hard to hear in high school. Sound. And how terrifying is that? and words they may seem like nothing unusual but to one group of teens these can be powerful tools especially when you see so much st bad stuff going on it's always good to see you know the positive that's going on they call themselves breakdown tucson a group of about 30 teens from different schools who encourage their peers to do the right thing through dance music and real life stories amy dobbins started the group back in 2001 to spread a message of choice they can always have the excuse, I, don't know, I didn't know because nobody told me. And we wanted to eliminate that excuse for them so that they would know that if you do certain things, there are certain consequences um, and really give them an opportunity to make the right choices the first time. Today, the group spent the day practicing. Haley Benson, a senior, says she joined because of the message. I think that it's really incredible that um, someone can say, like, I've been there and I understand how you feel and I can tell you there's a different way to go that will lead to better things in your life. The same reason Lexi Gerard, a freshman, also joined. It's one thing for your mom to be telling you, no, that's, that's not good, don't do that. But when other teenagers your age are telling you, like, um, like giving you advice, it's a lot easier to follow. Before her mother, Angelica Lopez, it's an effort to stop bullying in our schools. Thank God for a show like Breakdown that is actually trying to make an impact on those things. It's trying to break behaviors like that. Now, Breakdown Tucson will be having their first show on February 16th at the Grace to the Nation's Church. It's free and open to everyone. Now, Breakdown Tucson is a nonprofit organization, correct? So yeah. that means that they need community support? They absolutely do need all the help that they can get. They strictly rely on donations to help put on the four to five shows they have throughout the community at assemblies. That's well, important. So. Thank Definitely. you, Alexis.